It is a stadium that has a feel very much of its own. I'm talking, of course, of Craven Cottage. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Fulham versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's the starting 11 for Fulham. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. The initial 11 for Wolves. Joao Moutinho plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Diego Costa. And they kick off here. Palinha. Tete. Reed now. Reed. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Diego Costa. Diego Costa. Nicely timed tackle. Well, for the visitors, an awful lot they need to do better in terms of scoring goals. Look at that record, Stuart. Not a pretty sight. Well, on the road, they're just too negative in their attitude. Whether that comes from the coach or the players, only they will know. But unless they can be more expansive in their play, they'll struggle to score again today. Dangerous looking attack. Now well, they stopped them in their tracks. And Wolves in a position of menace. Oh, it might be. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Mitrovic. Well, great read there to intercept. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. Nunes. And there to intervene. Bully Reed. Reed now. Thank you. Pereira. Reed. It might appeal to Willian. And the danger still on. Real defensive resilience. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And that puts them in position. Well, nothing productive, really.
Harrison Reed. Bobby Reed. Now with Mitrovic. And Reed with it. Pereira. Chance to cross. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Well, that is how to play advantage. Can he do it? Foiling his opponent completely. And foul it is then. William and continues his run and the snuffing out of the cross there <laughs> trying to deliver it accurately and a squandered opportunity there. Well, as you can see, Wolves are struggling to control possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. Wang Hee Chan. The ball with Podence. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, keeper dealt with it. And the short option preferred. A routine save. Harrison Reed. Mitrovic. So almost at the break here, and not quite going to plan for the home side. Work to do, Stewart. Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attack. Oh, the chance is on, Stuart. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. William. Reed. And space to cross it. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. And the referee's whistle. We're officially at the halfway mark here in West London. And underway again. So advantage Wolves after the first 45, but still plenty of time for a few twists and turns before this one is over. Well cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. Well worth, I think, at this stage, going back to the chance from earlier. And taken short. 
defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. They favoured a short one here. Timely intervention. Kenny Kete. Reed. A very timely interception. And well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. And players waiting in the centre. Able to get a body in the way. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. But it did look dangerous for a moment. But the keeper has it now. William. Pereira. Plenty of options. Good tackle, take it away. Nelson Semedo. Robinson. It's with William. Pereira. Harrison Reed. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Chance to cross. Very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, those stats confirm it. Fulham have enjoyed the majority of the possession, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. Absolutely, and looking to try to take advantage of the possession here. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Podence. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Oh, they've lost it. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Clean challenge. And beating the defender. Shielding the ball superbly. Couldn't grab hold of it. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, Leno has kept his team in it there. They aren't playing well, but that might just inspire them to get back into this match. And Willian on the move here. And let's give credit to the defending. Nunes. Attacking possibilities for Wolves here. Is this the moment? Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Well, they've decided to make a change. Taken short. But he could really get at the opposition. Well, tremendous block. Another corner. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Now, how about the short corner?
Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. And so into the final five minutes. Two nil now, and back underway. Substitution for Fulham coming off the pitch. Number eighteen, Palinha, to be replaced by. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Podence running with the ball confidently. Well, disappointing end to the move. Chance to play it in. And space to attack. It has to be! Terrific piece of anticipation. So the referee says that will do it for this match anyway, and it goes into the history books as a win for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, we talked about their struggles in front of goal, but today they were excellent going forward. There was a real zip about their passing, and the movement off the ball was just as good. That was so much better.